here. Okay, is this I want to hear your opinion. Wait a second. This. First of all, is this your last one? Yes, last one. We are on designboom.com. Hang on a second. <laughs> what? But you just hit a home run, Will. <laughs> we can end off with that. You just well, look hit at a this home one. run. What, are you going to sell this to me? Go ahead. Uh, so this is a flower pot as a designer item that you actually wear. <laughs> you wear a plant on your back. How do you know this is real? It's There's a designer to it. How do you know this is real? Like real, real? Uh, I, I don't. Can I buy it right now? Uh, for those people are wondering right now, there's there's a like a promo video for this product, this flower pot that you carry everywhere as a backpack. It's a promo you, video, and yeah, she's you strap wearing it on, and 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 it's like this good looking person playing with their hair and and having their having their plant with them at all yes. times. Do people have a relationship with their plant like this? I think so. I think a lot of people do. Do you have a relationship with a plant like this? Not me. Okay. No, so, but. Somebody uh, does. You, you wear it as an ornament, as some sort of fashion accent to uh, your your outfit. Wild. And you grow it. It's a wearable vase. And look at the, imagine the Instagram photos you can get. In front of the Eiffel Tower. Is it healthy for the plant? I mean, how long does the plant, uh, is it is is the plant robust enough to live as, as part of this portable vase? Like, aren't the leaves and things falling off what about when you set it down what if you sit down accidentally it's all getting scraped and killed yes <laughs> absolutely but uh in the face of fashion it doesn't really matter right it doesn't <laughs> i guess not yeah i mean maybe for maybe for a real statement every once in a while but if, uh, if all of a sudden you show up to work, you show up to work <laughs> every day up with a couple of these and it's just like your usual self, except mm -hmm. every day your plant goes with, with you, just like how Otis goes with you yeah, or your hat or whatever is your normal attire. And then a plant is a part of it. First, I'm going to be like, wow, uh, -huh. uh, very ambitious. There's dirt involved. There's water involved. And then eventually, I'm just going to be like, can we be done with this plant already? Eventually, it's going to be very overwhelming. But what if it uh -oh. was like a... He just raised his finger like this. Yeah. A fruit plant. Mm. Or like a, a veggie <laughs> plant where I can just uh, reach, give you a tomato. <laughs> you know, it takes a while to grow How, a tomato, right? Does that work that way? You know, it takes a while to grow. Once you... It's going to take, you know... It's not like it will always be bearing fruit unless you have some GMO, some serious GMO <laughs> stuff going on. Otherwise, I'm that's gonna, what this is filled with. I'm gonna yeah. wipe out your tomatoes on day one. Otherwise, yeah. uh, I believe your last one with the migration was a home run. This is uh, this is more okay. of, this is more of a bunt. Yeah. Do, do you know what a bunt is? A little little bit of a strike. Not a strike. Or a hit. <laughs> a hit. <laughs> I, I no, I'm it. kidding. I'm kidding. It's interesting. I can't believe. Uh, yeah. You know? It's the internet, man. It's all out there, and I'm just happy that. Uh, it exists. I'm happy that things exist and people can make whatever they want. For sure. And design whatever they want. And that people can wear plants on their back if they feel it to be necessary. That's I love that. It's a good time. I love that. <laughs>